Oh, you're still awake. It's so late I thought you'd be in bed by now. Oh, I guess it's not too uncommon to have a pretty bad sleeping schedule these days, huh? Uh, oh, you... You were waiting for me to come home. <laughs> you didn't have to. You're so cute. If you say something sweet like that to me, I can't help but feel happy about it. Maybe I should give you a reward for being so adorable. How about a warm hug for your troubles? Uh, honestly, I talk about a reward, but I feel like I'm the one being rewarded right now. You're truly a safe haven in these chaotic times. What would I do without you? Just being able to see you sleeping soundly when I get home makes me feel better. But I don't mind being able to, to go to bed together for once. But try not to make this a habit, okay? I don't want you to be losing sleep all the time because of me. Come on. Let's go lay down. I'll be able to fall asleep quicker than usual since I can hold you tight while we fall asleep. I'm sure you can relax too since you won't be home alone. You don't feel anxious at night when I'm not around, do you? If... You do. You can always call me or, or text me. I don't mind talking to you for a while to help you calm down. You always say my voice is soothing. I, I don't really get why you'd think that way, but if it makes you feel better, then I'm, I'm happy. I know that. I saw you before I left in the morning, but uh, I really missed you all day today. I hope that doesn't make me sound too clingy. I just feel so at ease whenever I'm around you. I wonder what it is about you that just makes me feel so relaxed. I'm so happy I get to come home to you every day. I hope being cooped up at home all day isn't draining you too much. I know it's it's hard to stay inside all the time. Especially with such beautiful weather these days. Oh, I never imagined isolation would be this difficult to pull off. I know it sucks being away from family and friends and missing events we looked forward to but I hope you'll remember that things will get better soon even if things are going the way we want them to be at least we have next year to look forward to I'll be with you through all of it so don't feel too sad. If you ever feel like it's becoming overwhelming, I'll be there to share the burden with you. Just like you do for me. Maybe when things finally calm down and it's safe, we can go on a trip together. Just you and me. Wherever you want to go, I'll take you there. I'd do anything for you, my love buried. I try not to think about what I want to do in the future to help me get through the present, so maybe a vacation to look forward to will help you cheer up. I really want to go to Japan with you. Doesn't that sound nice? 
around this time that cherry blossoms would be in full bloom. Maybe we can go there next year together and and watch them. Only if you want to, though. For now, I'm really looking forward to just getting into bed with you. Come here, my love bird. I feel like we both deserve some rest right now. I get comfy. I... I really miss this. Nothing in the world feels better than holding you in my arms. It's almost like I'm melting away. Do you feel the same way? <laughs> That's good. I'm not the only one then. So, did anything interesting happen today while I was away? Huh. Nothing at all? Hmm. That sounds pretty tiresome, in a way, to be bored all day. Maybe I should buy some games to soak up your free time. Huh. I heard something about an animal game where they cross, where you make an, an island or something like that. I'm not really good with names, but I'm sure you'd love that game. I hope you won't become so busy that you can't spend some time with me anymore. I I promise you I can be much more entertaining than some game. But I'm sure you know that already. I sound jealous. Well, I just can't let you go, I suppose. I've said it before. I know I can be clingy at times, but it's hard to control myself. I have such a captivating, significant other. All I want is to hold you close and never let go. <laughs> but I know that you're the happiest when you're able to spread your wings, my love bird. I would be a failure of a boyfriend if I did something horrible, like... Like, luck you up for my own selfish desires. I know that there are others out there that, that fall to their greed and monopolize their partners. But I treasure you way too much to place my craving above your well-being. My only hope, my love bird, is that at the end of the day, you come back to me. Is that being too greedy? Oh, please. Don't say that it doesn't sound so bad. I might actually change my mind and keep you locked up in a birdcage forever. <laughs> I'm sure in stories it might sound nice, but... Uh, but I assure you, it would be a scenario you wouldn't like. Besides, I like the way things are now. I can hold you tight like this for a little while every day. Even if today was a drag, there's always tomorrow to find something fun to do while I'm away. Actually, now that I think about it, in a way, you're kind of trapped in my birdcage for the time being. Not that I want it to be this way. You know how things are out there. It's safer for you to be at home. Until things get better, that is. Although, if you're starting to feel a little stir-crazy, I can always take you out once in a while to grab groceries or... or 
go on a drive if you want. I don't mind. I just miss being able to take you on dates. There's something nice about being able to hold your hand and go on a stroll. I know we can hold hands at home, but I like to show off a bit. Oh, it's nothing. I'm just talking to myself. Oh. You really are so adorable. Maybe it's just because I'm tired, but I just want to shower you in my affection. My cute love bird. I hope we can stay together like this forever. I would be the happiest man alive if you would. How about we make a deal? I'll give you lots of hugs and kisses every day if you stay by my side. I do that already. Well, I'll give you ten times more then. How about that? Just to make this deal better, I'll even play Mario Party with you. If not Mario Party, then how about we watch your favorite TV shows or movies? Anything you want. Oh. <sighs> Anything for my sweet love bird. I just hope I won't spoil your rotten. You won't become naughty if I give you the world, will you? If you do, I guess I would have to punish you a little bit. But I know you're an angel. You wouldn't do anything bad. That's why I love you so much. Hmm. I feel like I'm starting to fall asleep. But I want to, to talk to you for a little while longer. I'm not bothering you for taking so long, even though you're staying up longer than usual, am I? I'm happy you're indulging me, but if you're tired... We can always talk more tomorrow. Oh, every day. Forever, if you want. I really want to spend the rest of my life with you. I hope you'll take me up on that offer I mentioned before. But for now, Let's just drift away and forget about the rest of the world for a while. I'll be sure to dream of you. I'm sure it'll be a very pleasant dream, my sweet love bird. Sweet dreams. I hope You'll dream of me too. Maybe we might be able to meet in our dreams or something. <laughs> Although, oh, I know that's a silly thing to think about. I guess I'm a bit more of the hopeless romantic type than I thought. <laughs> but you're the same way, aren't you? I guess we really are made for each other. Okay, okay. I'll let you sleep now, my sweet love bird. Thank you for staying up with me and listen to me rumble about stuff. 
You're so perfect. Don't ever forget that. That's why I'll keep you all to myself. <laughs> all right. 